All right, um, so welcome everyone to the Planning and Development Committee meeting of Monday, April 25th, 2022. Uh, we have a quorum, so I think we're ready to begin our business. Um, and the first item of business is uh, approval of the minutes of our meeting of April 11th. Could I have a motion so to move. that effect? So moved. Second. Thank you. And all in favor, please say aye. 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 Opposed, no. Okay, we have our minutes approved. Um, do we have any public comment? There's no public comment. No public comment. All right. Um, so we have uh, just one uh, main item of business, which is um, considering a referral made by uh, Council Member Sufferden. And basically, it deals with. Um, modifying the the dapper the design and project review committee process and um, uh, just to sort of set the stage I think since a council member suffered and isn't here with us this evening um, I think it, I I regret that he's not here because I think his input as to the the reasons for his making this referral would be helpful helpful to our discussion about this issue um, so I'm going to eventually ask that we table this or hold it or something. But it, before we do that, I'd um, be interested in knowing from the committee members if there are um, issues or questions that you have that you would like to staff to be prepared to answer when we come back to this issue. Or I could ask staff to make some comments to get us started. OK. OK, Council Member Reed. Oh, I was just going to say that I am in support of this. I think it uh, makes sense that we would, uh, uh, you know, I that we would get rid of this committee. Uh, it is a completely, it's a committee comprised completely of staff, which I think seems a bit uh, inappropriate given our form of government. Um, I appreciate the feedback, and I think there should be a mechanism for this group of experts to provide feedback to whether it's council or uh, to some other body. But I think as a committee that holds uh, what seems like some significant power, I think it makes sense for this committee to uh, be abolished. Uh, so council member Noosem, I saw your light. Thank you, uh, Madam Chair. I, I would like to hear more from Council Member Suffred and regarding his reasoning here. Um, having spoken um, with staff, you know, I think there is a benefit to having the staff uh, meet uh, with developers or with applicants to get everybody in the same room to sort uh, out uh, issues, uh, you know, identify and solve problems. Um, so I, I think the committee serves a purpose. Uh, if the contention is that having this be a public meeting is not super productive and uh, you know staff can continue to have this meeting on their own without public involvement, maybe that's uh, what Council Member Sufferden is suggesting. I'm not quite sure. Um, that's kind of counter to being more transparent, which is something that we're all in favor of. So, you know, I understand um, you know, some conversations can be more productive if uh, everyone's free to speak freely. Um, so I think holding this until we hear from Council Member Sufferden is a good idea. Okay, uh, Council Member Kelly. So um, I also agree with um, Council Member Sufferden and Council Member Reed about um, eliminating this, this committee. I, since it's for introduction, um, I would propose that we move forward um, and consider it uh, so that at least it moves along to, because um, Mr. Sufferden will be here. If we move uh, introduction, then it would go on right on to council tonight. So I, I, I don't, I I don't think sorry. we're quite okay. ready for that. I, I, then I withdraw yeah, that. It, yeah, there might be some more okay. changes we want to make, mm -hmm. uh, which is easier to do mm -hmm. before we introduce it. Yeah. No, I, I think it would be helpful for us to have a clear understanding of exactly what the committee, what kind of input the committee provides, both to the applicant and, for example, to the Land Use Commission and, and then ultimately to City Council to understand, you know, what is, what is the, 
the, the best process for um, making sure it works effect effectively and efficiently. So um, uh, any other input before we adjourn our very <laughs> efficient meeting here? Um, so I guess I'd uh, like a motion then to um, Are we going to hold this to hold the this? table till a date certain or hold it until our next meeting? Yeah. What, what would staff recommend? Well, if there's no further work that you want staff to do. Um, oh, you lost your quorum, I think. Yeah. I, well, I think other than being per, perhaps you, for the next. Three. Oops. Uh, I, would, I would suggest um, preparing. Um, He's not a member yet. You do uh, not have quorum. Do we not have a quorum? No, because Juan Shoot. is not a member. You do not have quorum. Okay. One, two, three, four. Need four. We have. We have. Don't. No, he's not. A, he's not a member. We need one more member. Oh. Yep. Well, I, I think it just gets hold, held administratively then. <laughs> right. Yeah. Um, so I was mid-sentence. Um, I think what, what would be helpful for our discussion when we do come back to this would be a, a presentation from staff as to the, you know, the role of the committee um, and the, you know, the kinds of uh, input they provide both to applicants and to um, various city commissions and committees. Um, and, and Council Member Kelly, you had your light on at that point also. I just, is there any way that it could go to a subsequent city council from here or no? I mean, in terms of, so we would bring it back to P&D next month is that what at, we're at our thinking? at our next meeting would be the okay. idea. Okay. I mean, I'm I'm not convinced that there's super urgency in this. That okay. you know, waiting two more two or three weeks isn't going to hurt okay. things. Cool. Um, so, okay, Councilmember Reed. I, I guess uh, if uh, are you seeking to move this forward, Councilmember Kelly? No. No. Okay. Oh, then never mind. Okay. So could we? Yes. Thank you. Fine. Second. Okay. It's been moved and seconded that we table this uh, item to our next uh, P and D meeting. Uh, all in favor, please say aye. 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 Okay. Then uh, that's what we'll do, and that's the end of our agenda. So I consider us adjourned. Thank you.